Hi yo, what is up everyone? In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to get more FPS on your laptop or any type of device, but mostly for laptops. Since a lot of people in my comment section have been saying how uh, their laptops only run like 60 FPS, 30 FPS, whatever. But it doesn't need to be a gaming laptop, but even if mine is a gaming laptop, I boost my FPS. When I first bought my gaming laptop, it was like 90 on pubs and arena, and it was like 120 on creative. Now it's like 160, 180, sometimes like 200. It really depends. So, first thing I, get, I want you guys to do is copy all these settings. Not not these top, but I'll tell you guys what to do for this top and the buying it and copy that. But make sure everything's on low. 3D res doesn't really matter, it doesn't really affect your game. B sync off, motion blur, direct. You can either use 11 or 12. I heard 12 gives you more FPS, but I use 11 because you know I've been using it and it still gives me decent FPS. Allow multi rendering uh, on, GPU crash debugging off. Oh. All right. All right. Next thing uh, to test if your FPS is pretty decent, uh, just cap it at 120. And if it doesn't move like mine right now, like it doesn't move. You see, like, like the, you can see the top. It doesn't move that much, so it co stays constant. One point break. All right. Usually everyone knows like so. I play on full screen. Don't don't ever play on Windows full screen. Uh, full screen less input delay, uh, more FPS. All right. So the first thing you guys want to do. This is only for your Fortnite game so far. We still have to optimize your PC settings, like your Windows and all that stuff, right? So first thing you guys want to do. Setting setting. You can either choose one of these two. One of these two. Uh, the default is native, which is 1920 by 1080. But I use 1600 by 900 because it gives me a better FPS boost. And if you guys don't want one of these two FPSs, I mean, uh, stress. Uh, I'll teach you guys how to do it when we optimize the PC but you can change your res so first first step is to change your uh, res so 1280 by 720 insane FPS probably it boosted by 30 but the graphics are legit horrible so let me just show you guys uh, like it looks so it looks so pixelated so let me uncap it okay, 240 it looks so unlike pixelated right now I'm getting around 200 to not 190 fps all right 200 to 100 to 900 fps on creative that's that's really good for your laptop but you know it looks like it looks so pixelated i don't know it's probably my own preference um if your laptop doesn't really do that well with performance and fps and all that stuff i suggest you guys use this which is uh 1280 by 720 the FPS boosts a lot. It goes up to 200 for my laptop, and my laptop is like one year old. Got it like 2020, uh, it's about to be 2021. There's like a newer model for it. It's a 1650 uh, with an i5, but yeah, it has decent FPS for like 720. So yeah, I'm gonna show you guys my personal favorite one, which is the one I use, but it's probably less FPS than the one we just saw. Alright, the one I use is 1600 by 900 and it gives me around 170, 160 FPS. So, but it gives me way clear, it's like way more clear to see stuff. You know, the one I used before that I just showed, like, I barely, in like Arena, I can barely even see if that's a person or like a tree or something, you know what I'm saying? So, like, I just use this one. It doesn't really matter, it's only 30 FPS more. But first of all, if you guys even want to have better FPS boost like for performance, I suggest you guys connect your FD, uh, your laptop to a monitor. But I don't do it because um, uh, my monitor is like a 75 hertz septum monitor. Uh, it's not really that good, but like you know, so I can play on my laptop screen, which is a 60 hertz. But you can get laptops with a 100 144 hertz display. So yeah, I'm getting one. 7160 FPS right now, which is my this is my own setting. It's the like, the red I use, but there's different res that can give you better FPS, and I'll teach you guys how to do your custom res in a bit very soon. But um, now we're gonna go and optimize our PC settings, and 
your FPS will be even better than usual. So right right now, if, even if you do these morning settings, your FPS won't be as good as mine from like 160, 200, and all that stuff. You still have to optimize your PC, which is doing a few settings. But yeah, I'll teach you guys how to do that right now. Alright, everyone. So to do your FPS boost for your optimizing your PC or your laptop, mine is a laptop. What you do is click on settings and then go to system and then go to notifications and access. Make sure it's on off because you don't want notifications when you're playing Fortnite because it runs something in the background and your FPS will be worse. Alright, that's all I got to say. Alright, next, it's really simple by the way, everything I'm showing next. Uh, you guys want to go to power and sleep additional power settings. And right here, right? Usually, usually there's not, there's only one, uh, one option right here, which is only balance. But I had to create my own plan, right? So I just like messed around with it, you know, change plan settings. And you guys can just like, I forgot where it was, but like, you can like customize your plan or whatever. And then mine is on like highest performance for my custom plan. So you guys want to uh, either create one or if it shows right here, uh, it has high performance and then it does my batteries. Really. But you can create a custom plan, click high performance, you know, name it anything. So make sure you guys name it something that you should do. All right, so do that and you will have it. Turn off the display, make sure it's on never for all these to create and you have it now your custom plan uh yeah you should you should really do what the custom plan says all right guys next step is go to your control panel right here click on system and security click on system and right here advanced systems settings you guys want to click on advanced i don't know where it usually shows up but for me it's advanced click on settings and you guys can either do uh, usually it's right here and adjust for best appearance but your FPS will drop a lot more probably like 30 40 so you guys can either do adjust for best performance or custom but for uh, custom what I do is usually I click on uh, let me see where that is uh, it says something about tips oh, hold on let me read that this is mine right here. Show thumbnails instead of icons and smooth edges on screen fonts. Make sure to press on those, click OK. Next, you guys will need to go to your NVIDIA. NVIDIA. People freaking say I'm retarded for saying NVIDIA, but NVIDIA, NVIDIA. It's whatever. All right, go to GeForce Experience for NVIDIA. Just search it up. No. GeForce experience and then you guys want to wait till it loads up so you guys need to make sure that this is up to date with your drivers and all that stuff so you see mine is still not up to date for some reason so one guys want to click on download and what this does is make your nvidia way better and your chilling 